Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have two water marble designs for the St. Patrick's Day. As you can see, both designs have green colors in them. And all the nail polishes that I use will be listed down below in the description box. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm always starting with room temperature filtered water. And go ahead and add in your polishes. In this case, I am using a dark green and gold and just go ahead and build, build up the bullseye. When the polish is not spreading well, just go ahead and shake the cup to help it spread more. There is the bullseye, so let's go ahead and do the design. For this design, I'm just gonna go back and forth and the key is to not start from the outermost um, ring of polish because that's already dry. And now go ahead and do the same thing, but now in the opposite direction. So as you can see, that adds in a lot of details. There's our design. Now you don't have to rush, but go ahead and dip in your nail. Pick the best spot that you like, dip in, and go ahead and blow on the surface of the polish so that it dries faster. And just blow some more so that it dries really fast. And now just go ahead and pick up all the residual polish on the surface of the water. Make sure the water is really clean before you take out the nail. And now just slowly take out the nail and that will avoid bubbles. There is our design. Let's go ahead and get started with our second design. For the second design, we're using three shades of green. A darker green, a medium green, and a light green. And just go ahead and build up the bullseye. And again, when the polish is not spreading well, just go ahead and shake the cup a little bit so that the polish would spread. There is our bullseye. And let's go ahead and get started with our design. For this design, we're doing it very, very simple because we're just doing a uh, clover design. So let's go ahead and just do a four leaf clover. And for this design, we're going for the center. So we want to go ahead and get that as nice as possible. So get, go ahead and clean up the center and make the leaves more beautiful by just um, kind of um, correcting the size of the leaf like you see right there and dip in that little bubble um, so that everything is nice and um, uh, sharp. So there is our clover design. And go ahead and dip in and we're gonna just go ahead and pick up the center. Again, blow on the polish so that it's dry and it's very easy to clean up. And just go ahead and uh, clean up the surface of the water. Lift out the design and there is our clover design. 